everyone, so this is going to be a Lidl and an Ocado delivery. Excuse my voice, I've had a really sore throat the last few days and I've got a horrible cold now, which is irritating. But I feel okay, I just, I can't, I feel like I have really swollen glands. Anyway, I spent, today's Monday, I've actually got an Ocado delivery, just a little bit of a stock up. I think I've got like 40 odd pounds of Ocado, which I'm going to add to this haul as well. I spent 44 pounds at Lidl. That is with my 10% off coupon and I got two free items. So I will show you what I got. Okay, so I've got the Jersey Royal potatoes. Love those, two packs of those. Again, I've just been roasting them, boiling them for like potato salad, chips, whatever. I just, I feel like they're just a good all rounder for this time of year, especially with barbecue food. I've got two garlic baguettes. One's gonna go in the freezer and one we're gonna have tonight for bolognese. I've got some sweet peppers, I fancied hummus and peppers for some reason. Um, got some piccolo tomatoes, which are just my favourite ones that I always get. Corn on the cob, I usually actually, Violet doesn't eat corn on the cob, um, so I usually just cut them in half. Um, I prefer these to actually buy in the little coblets, I find you just get a bigger portion, it's the same price. Um, Italian style strong salad, I love that at the moment, throwing that into a wrap or a sandwich thin or bagel or something. Um, I've got some tender stem broccoli. I've got some celery and some ginger. I'm gonna get out my juicer this week and give that a go. Um, some sliced curly kale. I've got some of the little apples. The kids love taking those to school. My favorite golden delicious apples. Some bananas, cheese strings, some mozzarella for homemade pizza on Friday. Got Graham the prawn cocktail. He loves this in a, a roll or a sandwich or something. Um, I've got some creamy coleslaw. I don't know which one I brought last week, but it really wasn't very nice. So I got their deluxe one. Um, it's actually not much more expensive than their original. Um, great for obviously the barbecue salad-y food at the moment. I've got some milk, honey roast ham, and then I got the normal cooked ham as well sandwiches wraps i've got some chargill chicken breast which is what i like i throw that into a wrap or whatever um and then i've got the eat lean tasty mature cheese i haven't seen this one actually usually it's blue packaging i'm sure i've got the protein version grated coming in my ocado delivery but maybe it's different because it's mature i'm not sure anyway i'm gonna give it a go looks good and it was on offer um, and they've got the block as well. Um, I've got some yogurts for Miles. Violet actually eats these as well sometimes. My three lot of my protein yogurts, which I really like. The raspberry, the blueberry and the strawberry. I've got some extra virgin olive oil topped hummus with paprika chickpeas. This is really nice, this one. Miles loves this as well. Some tomato puree for our pizza. I've got some more marshmallows and some rice snaps for... I've been doing the kids' rice crispy cakes square thingies every single week. It's just a cheap, but also really nice sort of treat, school or after school. Got some more chocolate chips, because I just do throw that into baking. Got some pocket tissues, because we all seem to have like a cold at the moment. So I've got some of those. Um, some dried yeast, because I need it for pizza and whatever. Um, I bought this last week, and actually the, all the kids, I bought this for myself, honestly, all the kids love it. So I've got another, another loaf. Um, got some more hand gel and some ibuprofen, um, some of these dog things, they didn't really have much so I just got those. Um, and then these are my two free items, so I got some cheese curls, a 10 pack, and then also some malted milk biscuits. Miles loves these, he has these at Nana's so I think he's going to be very happy about those. And then I got some choco hoop cereal as well, so this came to £44 and like I said that was with 10% off and two free items. Yeah. So then in the next slide, you'll see my Ocado shop as well. Hi everyone. So um, I just want to quickly show you Ocado shop, 42 pounds. Do you want to see what I got? I ordered specifically a few things. This is why I ordered with Ocado. So I just added some extra bits on just to, well, you have to do like 40 pounds for a delivery and it's 99p um, delivery. Mm. Right. So I have a cough through this. I've just still got my cold and cough. It's just, yeah, never ending. Anyway, so I got some of these little Aptamel kids. Strawberry and banana. Mars already got one. 
and a peach. These are down to 125 a pack, which I don't think is too bad. So I thought, I'd, you know, it's just something different. Um, I've got my um, sauerkraut. Oh, I haven't had this in ages. Oh my God, I love this stuff. So again, it's just, I can get it from Ocado, I can get it from Waitrose. I just, there's nowhere else to get it, you know? I got two for two pounds, um, sorry, two for 250 on the Just Roll. So I got the puff and then I got the short crust. I've been doing my sausage rolls, pizza pinwheels, quiches. It's just convenience, but also it's just so useful having this and doing some homemade bits. Might try like a pie or something, um, but I did com I did kind of compare it to Lidl. So these are two; f they're basically one twenty five each in Lidl. They're one pound nineteen pence. Not really much difference. So I thought I'd just get those. You can throw them in the freezer. I got two for two pounds on the bagel thins. I love bagel thins. I actually find the ones in Lidl just are so dry, and actually sometimes the ones in Aldi are quite dry. So yeah, I always find it quite difficult to buy those ones. And these are my favorites, the protein ones. Anyway, I got the, just switch it up. I've got wholemeal and rye, and then the soft seeded. These are slightly sweeter. These are really nice. They actually had these ones in. I, I swear, every time I've ordered with the Cardo, I've had these subbed for these. Um, so I've always tried these, 21 seeds and grain. These are kind of their new ones in. Again, I just, this is the first time it hasn't been subbed, so I was very happy. These are 125, 125, two for two pounds. They're gonna go in the freezer. Don't really need them right now, but because I just basically like stock up, you know, I'm like, freeze everything. Um, I've got some eating rated cheese, this is on offer. So I've got that. I got two for, two for five pounds, is that right? Two for five pounds on the protein porridge. Again, cannot get this anywhere. Apart from a cardo, I think you probably get it in Waitrose, maybe Tesco. Obviously, I don't have Tesco local, but eight sachets in each. I love this, honestly. If you love porridge, this is it. Feels it seems extra creamier, which I really, really like. It's high in protein as well, it's, it's a bigger portion. Um, and I probably should have got four boxes, but that's just being greedy. So, anyway, I've got two boxes. I mainly ordered um, with a cardo for my zero zero pasta flour. This is the one I've been using for my pasta. M&S food one, um, obviously there's M&S on Ocado. So I'm gonna try it for pizza bases actually. I usually just use bread flour, but I might try it, it's gonna be different. So yeah, they're not an offer, they're just like £1.75 or something each. <coughs> white spelt flour, I thought I'd switch it up. I've been using just plain white flour. I thought I'd try to spell it, apparently it's slightly soft on the digestion. So I'm gonna try it uh, with baking and stuff. I got blueberry and vanilla rice cakes and veggie caramelized onion. So basically just a sweet and savory. I cannot believe how much these have gone up. I used to buy these at £1.20 a pack. Now they're £2. And this was £2.20 or £2.12, something like that on offer. Look at the pack's difference as well in size. It's insane. I got some ice solids. Graham always buys Cornettos and minty ones. And, you know, he tries to find things I like from Lidl, but I just... I'm just a bit fussy with ice creams. Um, so I thought I'd get these frozen yogurt lollies. They sound quite nice. I like quite a refreshing thing, like fruit based. He's the polar opposite. He likes all chocolate and mint. Um, and then I thought I'd try the Twisted Minis as well. So these were both on off. I think these are 175 and these were two quid. I got some yo-yo bears, strawberry and apple. Violet actually has always taken these to school. So I haven't bought them in ages again. I just can't get them from certain places and to be fair she hates the ones from Lidl. I think Lidl do them don't they? It was Aldi. She hates those ones. She doesn't like those. Just fussy but these are the real deal aren't they? The bare ones and they are really good. So I've got those. They're on offer. And then lastly just some toilet wipes for miles. So this came to £42 with that was 99p delivery on there. So um, yeah that's what I got. In some ways, the comparison is quite crazy, isn't it? Looking at what I got, but I suppose like flowers and porridges, the sachets have gone up so much more. Um, yeah, I mean, it's stuff that I need, stuff that I'm gonna use. So 42 pounds, I think it's horrendously bad. It's probably just a lot more than what it would have been previously, like before the hike. Um, yeah, so meals so far, we've done, I had a bolognese, done a bolognese on Monday. I did a curry last night, I'm gonna do Gammon steak, egg and chips. That was a Violet's request. Sorry, I'm literally coughing all my way through this. Um, 
I'm still unsure what I'm going to do tomorrow. I might grab something from the shop. I've actually got to be in the shop today, which is going to be quite hard, I think. Um, luckily, Wednesdays are quite quiet days. I've got lots of stuff to get on with. Um, Friday, I do homemade pizza. We might have a steak night over the weekend. And on Sunday, it's Graham's birthday, so we're having like a family barbecue with his brothers coming down from Nottingham. So, yeah, that is basically a rough meal plan. Um, I've basically been trying to use up stuff that I've already got. So I'd quickly add on some bits that Graham got from the farmer's market today. This doesn't include our fruit box, which you pick up later. So we've got two lots of strawberries. These were amazing last week. Flat peaches back, or donut peaches, whatever you want to call them. Oh, I just love these so much. Um, raspberries, we've got some green bananas. Loads of blueberries. Um, Fruited cabbage. Broccoli, spinach, we've got two lots of kale, and then we've got some bunched carrots. And then a couple of bits that he got from little white chocolate and cookies ice creams. Now they, I like, or at least I think I will like, because I love white chocolate. Um, crispy cookie, these are like the maxi bonds. Remember those? And then the mint ones that everyone loves. He also got me a fruit, um, pineapple and raspberry cider. He got me one, so I'm guessing it's because he's just testing whether I like it or not, but I do love a cider. Um, some ZX Cola salted pretzel, one of our favourites at the minute. And then lastly, some coated peanuts, which we haven't had in a while. We were eating them so often that I was sick of them, so I'm excited to retry them again.